to the boon yard to get loose Turn it up, going hard with my crew Move to the floor, everybody from the line It don't matter how you dance, let's have a good time Hey, this is Lisa from Crew Country Line Dancing, and I'm going to show you how to do the Barnyard Boogie. This is a 32 count, four wall, beginner, improver level line dance. It goes to Barnyard Boogie by Casey, featuring Stoney Murphy. I'm going to turn around and give you the best vantage point. You're going to start out with weight on your left. You're going to do a scuff through with your right, scuff through one, Step down two, and you're going to do two heel swivels for three and four and. Weight is going to go to the right. You're then going to scuff through with your left for five. Step down on six. You're going to do a heel swivel with your left, being off on the left, for seven and eight and. You're going to come back to home. Weight is going to be on that left. You're going to rock forward on one on your right. You're going to recover on the left on two. You're going to make a half turn over your right shoulder with a big step for three together four. You're then going to rock forward on your left, recover on your right for five, six. You're going to make a half turn over your left shoulder for seven and eight. For your third to eight count, you're going to do some heel heel with some slides and claps. You're going to take your right heel and put that out. You're going to slide the left behind and put that right heel out again. Slide behind and you're going to step to the right. You're going to touch with that left as you clap. You're going to do the same thing back to the left side. So you're going to heel and behind, heel and behind, step, slide, touch, and clap. Your last eight count, we just did our heel, heel, slide together. So weight is going to be on that left. You're going to touch the right heel out. You're going to swap and touch the left toe back. You're then going to bring the left heel forward, swap out and touch the right toe back. The count on that is one, two, three, and four. From here, you're going to do, you're going to be making some series of two turns to equal quarter turn. So you're going to step forward on that right. You're going to swing down. As you swing, you're going to make an eighth turn. You're going to step again, and you're going to swing and make a quarter turn. When you do this, you want to make sure that you come in, weight is on that left, ready to make that scuff through, stop your heel swivels. Now to do this through the counts. Scuff one, step two, swivel three and four, and scuff five, step down six, swivel seven and eight, and rock forward one, recover two, step three, together four, rock five, recover six, step seven, together eight. Heel one and two, and step three, together four, and five, and six, and seven together, eight. Heel one, so two. Heel three, so four. Step five, six, seven, eight.
So those are the basic steps of barnyard movie. There's lots of things that you can do to incorporate it into the dance that make it your own personal style. So a couple of things that I'm going to show you, some styling tips for this so you can make it your own. And your first day count when you're doing your scuff crew, some people may opt to do a little bit more of a lower styling option, loosen the heel swivels and keep it real low profile. One thing that you can do is you can do a big scuff and stomp down a little more predominantly. That's something that's up to you, whatever your personal style is. For the second eight count, some styling things might be a big slide as you make your half turn. So facing this way, when you rock, recover, you make your big slide, put a little attitude into it. Make sure you keep that weight on the right, rock forward on that left, recover on the right, and you can kind of slide back the other way. But the hips lead and the shoulders follow. So for the third eight count, some styling things that you can do is you can make your heels as big or as little as you want. You can keep it real low profile and do a heel, heel, slide together, make it real smooth and have a little swagger to it. Or you can do it up real big with some big heels and really emphasize that. On your slide, you can do again a big slide. You can stomp in place instead of just touching and you can give it a good clap. For the fourth eight count with the heel switches and the hips, you can go as big as you want on this as well. You can just do keep it little and just do some touches in place, or you can really add a little bit of a hip hop element to it with your touches and emphasis in making those moves big. With your hips, you can step forward, you can do them as sexy and as small as you want to, or you can do them big, do a real big dip, a real big pull swing into that, hip swing into that. Yeah. <laughs> 